there's a lot that is being said about Ricky on recent times. You have the opinion to say anything you want to say. Yes, guys, celebrities as themselves have taken up to themselves to post a lot about Ricky and lessons that we have to learn. The likes of Nina, the likes of Kenny, Pearl Tossi, Makadzi. The list just continues some easy and we can't just end it. I guess 23rd of February is a day that to remain in the hearts of a lot of people in the entertainment industry yes while others were commenting and commenting a lot of stuff that could help others forget about what is happening or help us try to move on someone jumped into the conversation and it's no other person than Alene Indoda she's now being roasted after she said this about Ricky on a tweet and I think somehow it doesn't it doesn't help at this point in time it does not even help yes as we talk about this welcome to my youtube channel welcome to the home of celebrity gossips if you're new here most definitely welcome please take so many of your time to subscribe to this channel give this video a like a comment on the comment section thank you for your love and support Ricky's rick's family have finally confirmed that a 34 year old rapper passed on this morning after posting it on social media from the statement the cause of his passing wasn't specified just yet however it has been assumed by many people that he took away his life it's actually true that he took away his life because a friend and a family member confirmed it to us he was actually battling with some mental health of course those friends fellow celebrities fans painted the tl with doves broken hearts scandals messages of depression big reels i mean sure enough twitter did not lose the opportunity to condemn cyberbullying and call each other for bullying ricky into what has happened right now i think it is very ridiculous that we need to have the conversation each and every time someone passes on we know very well that bullying does not help we know people are going through the pits but we only stick to that day when someone passes on that we continue the cycle to start talking and bringing up this topic about cyberbullying someone jumped into the conversation and it's not a person than Anne Lily in Doda. she never misses the chance of being a hypocrite she posted but carry on guys carry on like you always do implying that people should not be mourning ricky because they are actively participating in bullying him even though the signs were there that he is not okay i think that anele is not one to say such a thing she shamelessly called kelly roland ugly on twitter and did not fold even when she was asked countless times that she was wrong for bullying her how then does she condemn other bullies when her own incident did not, did not end with an apology kelly could have easily fallen into depression and taken her life away but instead of focusing on that anele chose to act holier than everyone else on twitter even with her track record so those are the comments you can see on the comment section there were a lot that were being said about her i think it's no time to start arguing or talking about different things which relate to ricky we should just pray things get better with the family especially the wife and the children thanks for watching this video until the very last end guys thanks for staying by please do well to share your comments down below in the comment section i think it's time for us to be aware of what is happening we should stop cyberbullying cyberbullying kills a lot i believe god has a reason for everything as well Yes, thanks for watching, thanks for staying by. Until then, still man, stay safe. See you next time, guys. Bye-bye.